Good morning. I'm Richard Schneider with Antennas Direct, and we are here this morning in Omaha, Nebraska, from the beautiful Old Market District of Omaha. So we are traveling around the country testing antennas. There are 1,700 television stations in the United States in 210 markets, and Omaha is the 73rd largest television market in the United States. Omaha has a population of just under half a million. And we have brought three antennas with us to Omaha, and we're gonna test them to see how many channels we can get on each antenna. We think we should be able to get hmm, anywhere from 25 to 50 channels maybe in Omaha. Antenna Point tells us that we are roughly 30 to 40 miles from the transmitting towers that service the Omaha market. So we're gonna put the antennas on the family truckster over here and we're gonna point them that way and we're gonna do a channel scan and see how many channels we can get on each of the three antennas. Now, coming to Omaha, I had some preconceived notions. I kind of thought it was a cowboy town. Uh, I thought it was pretty rural. And when we rolled in here, we saw 200 goths lined up to go to bingo. Uh, we've seen artists, hippies, hipsters, emos, everything of everything under the sun here. This is a very, very vibrant cultural area. And uh, it's been it's been quite a surprise and it's been a lot of fun uh, spending time here in Omaha. Um, I'm, I'm quite a, quite excited that we have the chance to, to visit here. And uh, what a great excuse to test uh, to test antennas <laughs> to get to come to a place like this. So uh, wish us luck and uh, we'll give you a report here in a second. Here are the results. We got 51 channels with the Goliath. We got uh, 56 channels with the Clearstream 4, and we got 56 channels with the Eclipse 2. And uh, the question is, why would a more powerful antenna get fewer channels? And the reason that is, is the higher the gain, the greater the directivity. So actually the Goliath actually rejects signals off access and off the back, and I just, checking on antenna point, there is one station that is not in this direction, but is actually in the opposite direction. So that's why sometimes a more powerful antenna um, won't get as many channels, is because it's more like a rifle rather than a shotgun. Richard, again, with Antennas Direct, we're back here at the office, and we just got back from Omaha, Nebraska, and we had a little bit of a different result this time than we did in the other markets. Um, Omaha is number 73 in the largest television markets. And when we did our channel scan, we got 81 channels. I'm sorry, we got 51 channels with the Goliath. We got 56 channels with the Clearstream 4. And we got 56 channels with the indoor antenna, the Eclipse Duo. And so what's unusual is a lot of people would be surprised that you got fewer channels with a more powerful antenna. Why is that? Well, an antenna is a lot like a flashlight, a very powerful flashlight. And when you focus down the beam, you get a very intense beam at the center, but you don't get much light on the sides. And that's a lot like this Goliath. You got a lot of energy that's collected in a very narrow location, but you're gonna reject signal off the sides and off the rear. So the Antennas like the Clearstream 4 and the Eclipse Duo are going to have more forgiving aiming characteristics. They might be slightly lower gain, um, but they're going to have a wider beam angle. So if you've got stations that are kind of spread around the area, um, those things might be a better choice. And we'll and, and consider those more like a shotgun. Maybe not quite as long a range, but a much wider coverage uh, area where this the Goliath is going to be a lot like a, a sniper rifle. Extremely long range, but you got to be a lot more precise, a little more precise with aiming. And it's going to have a much narrower beam angle compared to the tapered loops. So there you go. So worst case scenario, you're going to get 50 plus channels in Omaha.
Our next stop is going to be Topeka, Kansas, two hours south. So we'll see what we get in Topeka. Wish us luck.